How to use Google Sidekit for WordPress Easy Tutorial for Beginners Hi guys, welcome back. Today I'm showing you how to use Google Sidekit for your WordPress website. So let's get started. First, what you guys need to do is you will open up your WordPress website and you will go to your dashboard. This is where you will get. Today I'll show you how to use Google Site Kid, which is a plugin powered by Google that provides Google Analytics, Google AdSense, and different apps by Google to add to a certain website. And we will be adding it to our WordPress. So if you're looking for an analytics tool, if you're looking for AdSense, then Google Site Kid is going to be your option. So once you get to the main dashboard of WordPress, what I want you guys to do is simply scroll down to the plugin section and in plugins, you're going to click on add new. Right here in add new, we're going to search for site kit or G site kit. So here it is. You can see SiteKit by Google Analytics, Search Console, AdSense, and Speed. SiteKit is one-stop solution for WordPress users to use everything Google has to offer to make them successful on the web. It has 2 million plus active installation and is compatible with my WordPress version. In order to install, you will click on the install option given here. I have already installed it. That is why it says activate. So once you install, then you will click on activate and your site kit will be added as a plugin and will be activated. Now, keep in mind, if you want to add Google AdSense or if you want to add Google Analytics separately, you will still have to add the plugin of site kit and then you will be able to connect these platforms. Once the plugin is added, you will be able to find it right here. I'm going to click on the plugin and open it up. All right, so you can see right here, we have G Site Kit. I'm going to sign in with Google. Select your Google account. Then we're going to click on continue. And this is our setup. So the first thing is actually adding your website and you're going to click on continue. Then we have turn on the metrics, click on allow. These are the three steps. Then you have to click on next. You can see right here, this is my website and I have already connected my G site before. That is why it is saying it is already added. But for you, it will just say that your website is being connected. Click on next and these three steps will be done. Click on go to my dashboard. And here you have your dashboard for G Site Kit. It's so easy to add Google Site Kit to your WordPress website. You can see, congrats on completing the setup for Site Kit. Now, let me show you how Site Kit works. So, first of all, we are getting different tools with the Site Kit. As I showed you, we have traffic, we have content, speed, and monetization. So, with traffic, it's going to be, of course, our simple analytics with content and then we have Google speed and for monetization it's going to be Google AdSense so we have separate dashboards and separate sections for each of the different uh, factors on the website first of all we have traffic G site kit will allow me to set up the Google Analytics to see how many people visit my website from search and track uh, how I am achieving my goals uh, so it will gather the data according to the impressions according to the clicks and local search uh, how many uh, you know clicks I am getting and from where I am getting my audience what's the gender what's the age everything is done through Google Analytics and that will be added through this now Keep in mind, you will have to set up your Google Analytics account if you want to add it right here. It will, if you already have a Google Analytics, then it becomes easy for you. Otherwise, you will have to go to Google Analytics first and create your account there, set it up, and then connect it to your G Site Kit. Moving on, we have our content. So in content, you can see, see how your content is doing. This will be done with this search console. So if I click on search console, it will open it up for me, the Google search console. And I will just sign in with my Google account and it will take me right here. So with this, I am getting everything about my content, the performance, the different pages, the different blogs that I have uploaded, the articles, the pictures, everything. And you can see it's connected to my WordPress website. This is the website that I have on WordPress. You can see this is the same uh, URL. 
so it has been added to the search console here i can also add more websites if i want so this is how i will be tracking my content with google site kit and it will be done by google search console we have pages you can scroll down we have like page experiences core web vitals links settings everything so this is how it works moving on we have speed so for speed we have find out how visitors experience your site so again i can check it out by just clicking right here and it will take me to the speed largest contentful paint you can see right here then we have total blocking time recommendations with google site kit we actually get a really good insight and i don't think we need to go for a third party tool or paid tools to actually get the analytics to actually learn about the speed and everything you can just download one plugin install one plugin which is g site kit and you will be getting everything it's like a whole package so this is all about the speed we have radio css's properly sized images everything is calculated within the speed moving on we have monetization so we can actually make money with our website if you have a blog if you write articles we can actually run ads on our website and make money so monetization is the way and for that we will have to connect google adsense so again you will go to the google.com slash adsense and you will create an account there set it up once you do then you will click on connect your adsense account to your wordpress website website and you will be able to run ads earn money from your website focus on writing good content and let adsense help you make it profitable save time with automated ads now it's not like you will have to check every ad every time it's all automated and you just simply make money by running ads of course we can set up where we want to place the ads how the ads will look like so that's what we set up for our wordpress website and the google site kit helps us connect our google adsense and we will be able to make money so if you already use google analytics google adsense or if you uh, like the more insights with speed and content then you should definitely go for a google site kit instead of going for another platform or any other plugin so go ahead and just add the plugin of G Site Kit. Sign in with your Google account. You don't need to, you know, create an account or you don't need to actually do a lot. It's not complicated at all. I showed you the steps on how to set up your G Site Kit and then how to connect all of the different platforms included, all of the tools included, connect them to your G Site Kit and create a successful online website on WordPress. This way you will be able to improve the SEO of your website and actually rank your website higher in the Google search result. So go ahead and simply connect your G site kit. You can also go ahead and add more than website if you want. And if you have a hosting website, WordPress website, it doesn't matter. You can still connect your G site kit. The plugin is free. You can download it from the plugin section on WordPress. You can also go to the settings of G site kit. Here again, it will show you the different platforms if you have connected them or not. I have connected my search console and speed, but I just need to do some settings for the AdSense. Similarly, we have connect more services. And what we can do is we can also connect our tag manager uh, with our G site kit. And then we have our admin settings. So this is how you can set up and use Google site kit with WordPress. This brings us to the end. I hope that I was a big help to you guys. Don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up leave a comment down below turn on bell notification and subscribe to udf channel